a unique and memorable movie theater mm -hmm. in the heart of Hollywood designed to feature widescreen cinema. Tonight, our Desmond Shaw is taking a look at the Cinerama Dome and the plans for its future. Well, take a look at this striking structure. This is the Cinerama Dome. It's definitely one of the coolest movie theaters in the world, one of the most iconic structures in L.A., and as of now, it is not open for our enjoyment. First opened in 1963, just in time for the premiere of It's a Mad, 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 Mad World. The Cinerama Dome is unique in so many ways. This is what's called a geodesic dome. It's a concept that was invented by legendary architect and futurist Buckminster Fuller. The exact design comes from Welton Beckett and Associates. That's the firm that also gave us the Capitol Records building and the Beverly Hilton. And according to the L.A. Conservancy, the dome is constructed of more than 300 hexagonal and pentagonal panels, each weighing as much as 3,200 pounds. This was the world's first concrete geodesic dome, and as mesmerizing as it looks, it only took 16 weeks to finish its construction. So that name, Cinerama, that's a type of three projector technology uh, that was developed by Pacific Theaters. That's who built the dome. If you've been lucky enough to uh, see a movie here, then uh, you remember how wide the screen is inside. But what's ironic is that that Cinerama style actually was never shown here until the year 2002. This that was at the same time when the single screen dome was joined by the original Arclight Cinemas and 15 additional screens. Arclight was revolutionary in its own sense. So in a way, this site was the site of not one but two movie industry milestones, one in the 20th and one in the 21st century. Speaking of the Arclight edition, the original plans actually called for essentially covering up the front of the dome, making it invisible from the street. But grassroots organization and the LA Conservancy were successful in lobbying against that plan in favor of what you see today. But sadly, this was one of L.A.'s most well-publicized victims of the COVID pandemic. It closed in 2021, and everyone's been wondering about the future of the Dome. Now, the good news is you don't have to worry about it being torn down. It is a protected L.A. historic landmark. There was a lot of buzz about it possibly reopening in 2023, but according to Deadline.com, we're now hopefully looking at a reopening sometime in 2024. Apparently, the entire complex, including the Dome, is undergoing a huge refurbishment and renovation, but the Dome's owners have been pretty tight-lipped about uh, what they have in store here. I'm sure a lot of viewers have a lot of very fond memories of the Cinerama Dome. I certainly do. I remember I saw Starship Troopers here when I was a kid. I was absolutely wowed. And I know we're all hoping for a reopening sooner rather than later for this true Hollywood legend, the Cinerama Dome on Sunset Boulevard. Taking a look at this from SkyCal, I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, write us at look at this at CBS.com.